Hey curl friends, I'm Bianca Renee and you're watching Bianca Renee Today and today I'm going to be trying something random. Something that I've always seen and laughed at because it looks so extra. And that is a hooded dryer. No, not the ones that you see at the salons, even though I know some of y'all have those in your kitchen. Let me know if that's you being real extra. But um, yeah, this is like a DIY hooded dryer for you to use while you deep condition or maybe you're doing a twist out or I don't know what, it's an option. But I'm gonna deep condition today and give it a try to see how it goes. If you are new to my channel, welcome. I am someone who strongly recommends deep conditioning once a week. If you could just commit to deep conditioning your curls, meaning putting on a hair mask for a solid 20 minutes a week, you will see much healthier, juicier, defined curls. So if you have curly hair, that is one habit that I really want you to get into the motion of. Another habit that I do wanna bring up today before we get into the deep conditioning is to take your vitamins. Today's video is sponsored by Ritual. Ritual makes vitamins for women, for men, postnatal and prenatal. I've been taking their prenatal vitamins, but now that I've already had my baby, I've now switched to the postnatal vitamins. The vitamins are literally clear and you can go to their website and see exactly what you're taking. The postnatal vitamins alone have like 15 key nutrients that are gonna help fill in the gaps that our diet is not providing for us. Ritual is also a subscription service, so I will admit that I'm someone who like will take my vitamins and then wait till the last minute and be like, oh, I don't have any more, I forgot to order more. You don't have to worry about it because they will send you a new bottle every 30 days. So if you guys wanna give this a try because you need some more vitamins in your life, you could use my promo code BRT and use the link in my description box to get 10% off your first three months. So if you're someone who's planning on maybe expanding the family next year or you currently are pregnant, definitely check out these prenatal vitamins. They don't have that weird fishy aftertaste. If you've already had your baby, definitely check out the postnatal vitamins. But if baby is nowhere in your plans, that's also okay because they have a women's daily multivitamin as well. So check out the link in my description box and make 2021 the year where you take your vitamins every day. But okay, let's get started and see what this weird contraption will do. I'm going to be using one of my faves. This is the Curlsmith Deep Cream Deep Quencher for dry or dull hair for ultra moisture. Oh yeah, I forgot how thick this is. Let's get this moisturized. So here it is, straight in the bag, grantiva.com. Premium soft bonnet dryer attachment. I literally just bought some random one on Amazon, so I don't really have a preference if you guys want to try a different brand. This one was just reasonably priced. I think it was like $13 or something. Here she goes. <laughs> wow. So here's the hood. It has these little holes in it. Here's the nozzle. And then I guess we just stick the blow dryer in here. Now I just got the Dyson blow dryer. So in this instance, this actually is not gonna work because there's no nozzle to the Dyson. So I don't think this can strap on. <laughs> Hold on, let's open this. Maybe it will. Oh wait, wait, I lied. It fits. <laughs> So it can kind of go on the Dyson. It's just not gonna lock on there. It might be better to use a regular dryer. If I do grab the Diva dryer, it'll just go on like this, wrap around here. So you get a little bit more of a snug fit if you just use a regular blow dryer, which I think I just might today. Give my Dyson a break, you cute little thing. Okay, so I don't think we need to put a shower cap on top like I'm used to for my deep conditioning cap. So I'm just gonna put my hair up and away. Just, you know, loosey-goosey. I'm really making this up as I go. Now let's apply this very sexy hooded cap. Come on, dryer. Okay, here we go. things we do for our hair. Look at that pretty curl trying to get out. Let's seal it up. 
not your face. Nice and secure. I guess we could strap it like a little birthday cap. Oh, we're getting, we're getting cuter by the second. Give me a thumbs up if I'm turning you on. Okay, let's turn it on in three, two, one, blast off. enough. Let's take this down. All right. Seems to be soaked in there. Well, that was interesting. And here we go. The finished look. I mean, my curls look great. I guess I got the job done. Uh, it's just... <laughs> Honest opinion, this just looks hilarious. Like if my husband saw me in this, the heated cap is one thing, but this is just a lot. It's a lot going on. So this little hooded dryer was like 13 bucks off of Amazon. I'll link the one that I got in the description box. But even if you get a thermal hair care hothead heat cap, those are like 30 bucks. So technically it's double the price, but I would pay double just for the freedom. I don't want to just sit in one spot next to my blow dryer, have my blow dryer running for like, 20 plus minutes. I actually found a new heat cap brand called Mirake Wow, which is a very brand new small business Latina owned. So if you're looking for another type of heat cap, hers are in pink, they're really cute. I will link hers below to give you guys some options. But let me know what you guys think. Would you wear this thing to deep condition once a week? I feel like it'd just be another thing to make you like not want to deep condition. If you've tried it, let me know. I honestly don't think I'll be continuing to use this to deep condition every week. But if I do ever decide to do like a rod set or maybe a twist out, I have heard that the hooded dryer is like the secret ingredient to have a really good twist out. So I do want to attempt to do a rod set one day, maybe. And then I might use this again for that type of result. But the deep condition, I just don't think it was that necessary to have heat blowing on my curls for 20 minutes versus just having a little bit of steam from my heat cap. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I post new videos every week. I'm so excited for the new year. New year means new challenge. So leave me some suggestions on what you want the 2021 challenge to be. If you don't know what I'm talking about, every year I challenge all of my curl friends to do something to better their hair, meaning the no heat challenge where you don't straighten your hair for a year, meaning the deep conditioning challenge where you deep condition your curls once a week, the big chop challenge where you cut off all those dead, dried, damaged ends. And then this year was the hair growth challenge. So I will be asking all of you for your before and after pictures if you committed to my hair growth challenge this year. So let me know what you guys want the 2021 challenge to be and we'll get it going. I'll see you guys next year. Thanks for watching Bianca Renee today. Yeah.